Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Pooja. In today's video, I'll be showing you my 2021 bullet journal setup. So let's get started. So my first page of my 2020 bullet journal is the keys page. I thought it would be fun to actually draw a random old fashioned key. So that's what I'm doing here. And I wrote down my bullet journal keys beside it. So this is the first page I have done for my 2021 bullet journal. You can actually change the bullet journal keys as per your convenience so that it suits your schedule and tasks. Next up I did was write down 2021 in a huge bubbly font. The font was actually inspired by Alicia Souza's 2019 planner. And then I filled in using a black fine liner to make it thick and bold. I used a yellow jelly roll pen to give some highlights. At first, I thought of using white instead of yellow, but it wasn't opaque enough, so I went in with yellow anyway. And to my surprise, it actually turned out good. Next, I did a quote page where it said, let's do this again. So we all know 2020 was such a mess with the COVID situation and we weren't able to work on anything we dreamt of or we planned to do. So I thought 2021, we would all do the things that we failed to do in 2020. So that's what this quote is about. Then I went in and filled up using a black brush pen, which made my job easy and quick when compared to a fine liner. I also used the yellow highlights for the code page as well.
Next up I did was the future lawn where I used the same kind of lettering which is sans serif. Then I did mini calendar versions of all the 12 months. What I do in future log is that I note down important dates like birthdays or friends and family, holidays, things like that. So that you will know how your entire year is going to be and you could be prepared on the important dates and get yourself together and be organized. So there is no new year bullet journal set up without a goals page am i right so you have to fix your goals on the year beginning and it will be so satisfying to see that you have achieved your goals at the end of the year so here i am with this goal page where i did a very fun lettering where the alphabets are stacked in blocks in a very uneven manner so i had so much fun doing this little lettering piece and it turned out so good separate bullet journal spread for my netflix series and movies i am such a binge watcher and i love watching movies during my free time i thought i would keep a note of all the series and movies i watched this year it would be fun to just go through it and for the lettering stuff 
style it's the same sans serif with a little bit of red highlights since it's netflix i'll change the color from yellow to red all my series and movies in my ipad so i drew one and gave a heading for the series and movies so that i can note them down whenever i watch one We have reached the final 2021 bullet journal spread. So this spread is all up for my YouTube video ideas. I can go crazy. I can go mad with all my ideas. I would write it down here. So for the header, I drew the YouTube play button and filled it up with the red brush pen. And for the lettering, I used the same sans serif font and also drew a cute speech bubble for the ideas as well. time for the final flip through of my 2021 bullet journal setup. All my spreads turned out good and I'm actually happy about it and my favorite was the gold spread and the Netflix spread I would say. So let me know in the comments which was your favorite spread from my 2021 bullet journal setup. And also don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you enjoyed today's video and also hit the bell icon so that you'll be notified every time I post a new video. Until then, stay happy, stay organized. Bye.